What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Now, I know that we have probably some bigger names that I could have done, but I was pressed for time. I know that people want to see Paul Millsap, Patrick Peterson, Darren Sproles, Ronnie White. I know, I know, I know, but I wanted to do Lindell White because he was a monster in college and I was pressed for time, so I feel like it would be the perfect opportunity to drop him for you guys. So anyways, man, Instant Bay 04, my man Lindell White is a freshman and he's 80 overall with 85 speed, 40 awareness, 82 agility, 85 acceleration, 48 catch, 65 carry, and a 72 break tackle rating. Now he ran for 754 yards his freshman season, averaging 5.3 yards per carry, 13 TDs, 6 receptions for 15 yards and 1 TD through the air as well. And he had a huge game versus Washington State, 12 carries, a buck 49, averaging 12.4 yards per carry, plus a TD and a win. Instant Boy 05, he comes in at 88 overall, 87 speed, 78 awareness, 85 agility, 90 acceleration, 65 catch, 88 carry, 92 break tackle. He ran for 1,000. 103 yards as a sophomore, averaging 5.4 yards per carry. 15 TDs. I said 15 TDs. 15 of them things, man. 11 receptions for 97 yards and two TDs. Now, his best game came versus Colorado State, and he's from Colorado, believe it or not. 14 carries, 123 yards, averaging 8 point yards per carry, three TDs, and one catch for 22 yards. Look at Lindell White, man. The NCAA 06 presentation was beautiful, flawless, perfect, man. But anyways, he's 92 overall, 88 speed, 84 awareness, 86 agility, 92 acceleration, 65 catch, 93 carry, 97 break tackle. He ran for 1,302 yards, averaging 6.6 .6 yards per carry. 24 TDs his junior season. 24. 14 receptions for 219 yards and two receiving TDs. Best game was versus Arizona State. 19 carries, 197 yards. That's 10.4 yards per carry and two TDs, man. He was a monster. Now, he finished his USC career with 3,159 yards on the ground, averaging 5 point yards per carry and 52 TDs, man, in three seasons. 52! Anyways, man, for his NCAA career as a video game character, he's 86.6 overall. He turned that into a 45th overall pick in the second round to the Tennessee Titans, and he comes in as a rookie at 80 overall, 87 speed, 90 acceleration, 93 trucking, 62 elusiveness, 65 ball carrier vision, 95 stiff arm, and a 69 juke move as well. Now we look at his rookie numbers, they look like this, carried the ball 61 times for 244 yards, didn't get a touchdown, but he did average 4 yards per carry, he, he averaged 18.8 yards per game, he also had 14 receptions for 60 yards. His best game came in a loss versus Indianapolis, 13-14 was the final score, he had 8 attempts for 48 yards, averaging 6 yards per carry, 3 receptions for 7 yards. Madden 08 with his teammate Vince Young on the cover. My man Linda White comes in at 78 overall, 86 speed, 86 acceleration, 89 truck, 67 elusiveness, 70 ball carry vision, 92 stiff form, and a 73 juke move. Now, this was the year that he went off. Check it out. 303 uh, carries for 1,110 yards, 7 TDs. Averaging 3.7 yards per carry, 69.4 yards per game, 20 receptions for 114 yards. Best game was versus Oakland, where he had 25 carries for 133 yards, and they won the game. Now, moving on to Madden 09. 84 overall. This is his highest overall, man. 87 speed, 87 acceleration, 92 truck, 65 elusiveness, 92 ball carrier vision, 94 stiff form, and an 82 juke move as well. Now, your man Lindo White got into the end zone this year like crazy, man. He had 200 carries for 773 yards, 15 TDs. Averaging 3.9 yards per carry and averaging 48.3 yards per game. He had a huge game versus Kansas City. 34 to 10 is the final. 17 carries, 149 yards, averaging 8.7 yards per carry and three TDs, man. And he caught one pass for seven yards. Why not add that? Anyways, Madden 2010 is his last year on the Titans and his last year where he would actually play in a regular season game, believe it or not. 
So he's 79 overall with 78 speed, 87 acceleration, 94 truck, 55 elusiveness, 92 ball carry vision, 95 stiff arm, and a 65 juke move as well. He carried the ball just 64 times for 222 yards. He had two TDs, averaging 3.5 yards per carry, 17.1 yards per game. He caught three passes for 14 yards. Best game was in a loss to Indianapolis where they lost the game 9-31, to but he had 10 carries, 51 yards, and has a 5.1 average. In Madden 2011, he is a free agent, and if you remember, he was actually on the, uh, the, the squad for the Seahawks in training camp, but he did not make the team, which is sad because Pete Carroll, Carroll was his coach at USC and at Seattle, and he couldn't even make the team, man. But then he's back in Madden in Madden 2012 at 73 overall, 72 speed, 82 acceleration, 90 truck, 54 elusiveness, 83 ball carry division, 94 stiff arm, 72 juke move, and I believe he was just on the team for the preseason. And that basically is a wrap for his career. And Madden, he's 78.5 overall. His numbers finished like this. 24 TDs, 628 carries for 234 yards, 2,349 yards, excuse me. He averaged about 40.5 yards per game and 3.7 yards per carry. More through the years on the way. Make sure you subscribe. Until next time, peace. Hot sauce.